issue in you filling that deficit. Uh -huh. So one of the problems with this cat is that since there's nothing in his eye, uh, he may have, have you ever seen him that have a sunken, you know, where it sinks back inside right, right. the eye? Mm -hmm. So that's what you try to avoid. We may not be able to do that with this cat because he doesn't have this. So a lot of times you leave the, you take the globe out, like if it's not a, if it's not infected or has cancer, mm -hmm. you want to try to take the muscles off of the eye and leave as much tissue in that socket as you can so that you have so it fills up all the way to the skin so you just have a flat space up there instead of a sunken skull like look at that. Nice. Now I want something to keep any soap or anything out of this okay. good eye. So you took you took a lot of uh, eyes out in Africa is what you're saying? Large animals? Oh yeah. Man. That was a job. That was a job. <laughs> Because we didn't have any way to, um, didn't have any way to um, restrain these animals there. Oop. You don't have any way to restrain them? Yeah, so like a time up to a tree and we go around and around the tree trying to get them. <laughs> well, once he's been around the tree a couple of times, he'll be restrained. Basically, I'm just going to clean out the socket and close it down. So I'm hoping I'll get some bleeding in there so that it'll. Oh, so you're already sewing it up? Well, so I'm gonna go outside. I'm gonna take out the the, the lids and uh -huh. everything on the outside of the eye. Uh huh. So this is for me to have to hold on to. Oh, okay. Basically. So did you ever consider going to medical school, Doc? No, I never did. No. But the guy and uh, the guy that was the head of our class in our freshman year and sophomore. I guess he came to veterinary school because he couldn't get into um, med school because he got in and he left the school and it was good for me because then I became the head of the class. So he gets out, the body think it's a foreign body and you get a big reaction. It took me forever to get this cat to uh, straighten out. So, uh is it cellular? Is vitreous body cellular? Mm -hmm. or? No, no, it's just a jelly. Mm. It's just a jelly, but the way the eye develops, that jelly is never exposed to the animal's immune system. So everything else in the body, it knows that that's part of my body, but it knows that one. Hmm. So that little lump there, that's basically the interior of the socket of that remnants of the eye or yeah it's got the the lens in there you cut it up and look it. cut it up yeah, that's what it's had me along uh, the problem i had the vitreous in the back and i was trying to get all of that out of there <laughs> 